Hey guys, it's Patriots Man here, back with another video. And today I'm going to be talking about how I've made plenty of coins with the fan favorites promo. And there's plenty of time to go in this promo. We head over, we see that there is a good programs, a good four weeks. So we could be seeing new releases, new kinds of players and all that, but plenty of time to make coins. Now, this is how I've made, I'd say one to 1.5 million coins, somewhere in that range. And the best event you're gonna wanna play in order to start getting these coins is to play this 25 stamina blitz event which is the top event on the Blitz chain. Or not really a chain, but of the two there. So, it's 25 stamina each, and this is the one you're gonna want to play over and over because you'll get the 66 plus program player and you get those chances at pulling the fan favorite elites, which I did pull Alex Smith twice, so that was pretty insane. So we're gonna go ahead and do this event seven times here, auto it seven times, and see if we can pull anything here. But you'll see why this is worth it in a second. So there we are, we get one gold there, but that's absolutely okay because we can make all these silvers golds. This is very worth it. So I've been using all stamina on that. Then we head over to sets, and your coin making is gonna start right here. So what you're gonna wanna do, you're gonna wanna turn all your silvers into golds. So right here I'm going to just trade in all the silvers I have and claim my golds. So you'll see, take every single silver you have, unless you're using it for a fan favorite set. You're gonna wanna put it in for the 70 pluses because you're gonna use these 70 pluses to make coins. So I'm gonna go ahead and open the six of these right here, open all, see if we can get anything decent. Okay, so we get our 670 pluses there. And I'm gonna go actually down here. This is where you're gonna truly make your coins. You'll take all your 70 plus players, you'll see I have all these here, and you're gonna put them in for a 75 plus program player. The better the player you pull, the more coins you'll make. And these 75 plus program players are going for a really good amount of coin, good amount of coins now. So, let's see what we get from it. Three, two, one, and a 77 center. So that's a possibility to make good coins there. I'm gonna throw these in here, and to get the last two I need, I'll probably head here to Future Legends. Oh yeah, and I got plenty of these. For the purposes of the video, I'm just gonna open two of these so I don't take up too much time. And we're gonna go ahead and complete another one of those 75 plus program players so we go ahead go down to the core sets 75 plus program see what we pull here and we get a 75 tight end so that may not go for as many coins but it's still a 75 plus program meaning you're going to get some good coins from this so let's go ahead and go and try to sell these players we have so we got 75 Vance McDonald so you'll see here it's there's one up for a hundred something like a hundred thirty thousand right now um but i'm gonna go ahead and drop that price because i know that that itself is not selling so i'm gonna go ahead and price mine for eighty nine thousand nine ninety nine and then i'm gonna go buy now of say since it's a 75 101 thousand now based on the overall in position you're gonna wanna search it up and make sure that you're not pricing them too low. Cause you will get a good amount of coins from these. But for a 75 tight end, obviously it's not gonna be too high of a price. So I'll go ahead and post that. And then 77 center, you can see we do have a few here that are sitting at around 110,000. And they've been sitting for a little bit. So I'll probably price him similarly to Vance McDonald's. I'll just go with that price right there. 100,000 bid basically and 105,000 buy now. And you'll see all the way up to 5.1 million from 3.8, 3.7 million, somewhere around there. I do have the 75 corner here I can try to sell. 
I've had to post them a few times, so I'm going to post them a bit lower. Hopefully he gets bought. So yeah, you'll see. That's how I've been making the majority of my coins. So just a quick recap. We'll head over to programs and fan favorites. So you can see they do have these events here, these uh, division ones. You can go ahead and do these if you really want to. But you're going to be getting the majority of your... Um, the majority value is going to be coming from these Blitz events here. The 25 stamina ones specifically. So, basically, you keep spamming this over and over, as I've said before. Turn those 60, uh, 65 plus you get in for 70 plus down here. And take all your 75 plus and put them in here for 75 plus players. And you will sell those 75 plus players and make yourself coins. That's what I've been doing. Another way to get... Um, program player 70 plus to put in for 75 plus is these future legends as you've seen me completing here you'll get these tokens as you play the blitz event too so you know it's like a win-win and everything and then you know you'll be able to buy players that you want with all those coins as you see i'm saving them so yeah that's about it for this video i wanted to cover what i've been doing for coin making in this promo haven't done a coin making video yet so i just wanted to get you know a quick little guide to how I'm making coins here some people have asked me so if you did enjoy this video make sure to drop a like if it helped you out a little bit and subscribe to the channel if you're new to help me get closer to 500 subscribers I'm Patriots Man I'm out